This lesson is on importing an exam view test bank. If your curriculum is available in an exam view test bank, this is the easiest way to get questions into the CPS system for use with your class. You will notice that on my desktop I have a folder named exam view test banks. This is where my exam view test banks are stored. You will need to know where your exam view test banks are stored on your computer to do this. We will open the CPS software by double clicking on the CPS icon, which will bring up the main CPS software window. And we want to be sure that the Prepare tab is selected. Once we have selected the Prepare tab, you can see that the CPS database is there. And we want to create a new folder to store our exam view test bank. So right click on the CPS data. Go to New, go to Folder, and I'm going to name this folder Networking 1 because this is a lesson for a networking class. So we have Networking 1. I'll click on the folder, then right click on the folder and go down to Add Files. At this point, you will need to navigate to where your exam view test banks are located. Desktop. Exam view test banks, double click there, and we see the exam view test banks that are available. I'm going to load NE01.01. .01. I'll click on that and tell it to open. You will see that the test bank appears in the pane, and if you click on that test bank, in just a moment, it will give you the name of the test bank and it will also show you the questions that are associated with it. This particular test bank has 15 questions which can be used in classroom sessions with your students. And that's all there is. Uh, remember, you need to know where your exam view test bank is. You need to create a new folder for the lesson that the test bank represents and you just need to bring in the test bank. This is the end of the lesson on importing an exam view test bank.